Welcome to Summon Awesome Games. Good looking people, I'm Rob. We are playing Animal Crossing Pocket Camp. And my little dude's got no shoes on. Acorn Squid. Good for him, right? We're now level 18. And let's see what's going on. We've got probably coins, right? Bells from helping people with their uh, shovel strike quarry. Which, can we do that? Can we do that? Tell me we can do it. Tell me we can do it. No, we can't do it right now. I did it last night before bed. So I'm not allowed to do it now. Uh, I've noticed sometimes the reward is golden. Like you can see that reward there with the steel. Sometimes that is golden. So you assume you get better stuff. A lot of animals want a lot of things today. So we're going to be dealing with them. Uh, let's go and see. What have people bought? What have we got? What have we got? What did I sell? Oh, we sold a couple of things. We sold uh, oranges to my wife. Okay, so... Mel, Mel has been on. She's buying my oranges. She wants oranges. They're a good deal of all the people to buy them. Uh, and then Big Gucci bought some coconuts for 410 Now we have... Oh, I want to show you. If you want to be that person, we got a $10,000 beetle here. Oh, look at him. Look at him. This one's a little bit cheaper, so get in first if you want that one. They're worth 15,000 bells if you want them. Two butterflies for 150 Solid deal there. Uh, these red snappers, they're a thousand each, but we've got them on a little bit of a discount here. A little bit of a special. And we have a lot of listing boxes now. A lot of them. Uh, what do we actually have? Let's check our inventory. Uh, we have another one of those $15,000 beetle. A tuna. Now this fella, can you guess how much he's worth as a value? 50,000 bells! What?! That's insane. So if you see someone selling one of them for a few thousand bells, grab it. That's 50,000 bells he's worth. Uh, Rainbow Trout, we know. 15,000. So the tuna is the rarest of all the ocean fish. 50,000. Crazy. Have not caught a koi yet. The tuna is very easy to spot. It's humongous. When you see it in the ocean, it is humongous. It's so easy to know what it is. You're just like... That's a sea monster. That that's that thing is gigantic. The koi, I haven't seen a koi yet. Or at least I haven't caught a koi. I probably have seen a koi. I just didn't try to catch it. Um, so I don't know how big a koi shadow is in this game. Uh, we'll have to look it up, man. we we'll have to look it up. See how it is big in Animal Crossing games. I think I don't think they were huge. I think they were large. Like, you know, how an olive flounder is large here. But, like, that's a horse mackerel. That's probably an olive flounder. Let's find out. Let's see if my my uh, fishing knowledge is... Could be a squid, actually. It is a squid. It is a squid. Is there an olive flounder? That's a horse mackerel. What's up, purple hair? Lucky hair. Janae? Want to be my friend? Do you want to be my friend? What you got for sale? You've got... Is this the $15,000 beetle for $1,000? I'm going to buy that. I'm gonna buy that. That is it. That is right. That's not my. I'm not imagining that. It's not. Damn it. That is a thousand dollar beetle. It's the one with the big, big snappy thing. I don't know. Mandibles. That is the fifteen thousand dollar one. They look the same, man. When you forget what they look like, everything looks the same when you forget what it looks like. Uh, so that is probably a horse mackerel. That's a squid. Actually, it might just be the squid owl. I don't think any of these are um, olive flounders. Except for that first one we caught. Yeah, they're all squids, man. They're squid sizes. So you can tell the shadows. So when you see a shadow that you look looks unfamiliar, you're like, that shadow looks quite huge. That shadow looks a little bit different. It's probably a rare fish. So learn your shadows. Very important. Here you go, bunny. I like her name. She is a rabbit. So they call her bunny. There you go. Enjoy that. Enjoy it. Request complete. We are going to uh, invite someone. Let's invite someone to our town. Surely we've... Or camp. Not town. Camp. Let's invite someone to our camp. Surely someone wants to come to our camp. If not, let's see what we can put on the old build queue. Once we knock off bunnies, happiness things here. Have some coconuts. Have some apples. I feel like a coconut merchant in this game. My, my highest selling product is coconuts. I really wish someone would buy those beetles. I don't think they will. Because I'm still not sure what they're for. Um, what I have noticed 
what I have noticed, this is what I've noticed. Ready? Sit down for this one. Um, so, okay, so Bunny here, she wants three fruits. So, they pay full price for them. So if we give Bunny an orange, a coconut, and a peach, they're worth 300 bells. So Bunny will give us 300 bells. So, ta-da, here you go. You don't, need, you don't need creatures to craft, right? You don't need bugs to craft. 300 bells and some wood. Bugs aren't crafting, fish aren't crafting. So really, having my beetles in there for a solid, a solid price of 15,000 bells is stupid. To put them on the market is dumb. For me to have that beetle, that beetle, those red snappers on the store like that is dumb. Because if we come to a part where an animal goes, you know what, I really want one of those Miyama stags. Or I want a red snapper. They will pay full price for it. So we will get 15,000 bells for those beetles. Where here, I'm making a loss if someone buys them. Someone buys them, keeps them in their pocket. Some when a little animal wants to buy it off them or wants one as a request. They make that money. They make a profit. So me having them on that store is dumb. So you probably won't see any more rare things from me up in my store. Definitely not that 50,000 bell tuna. If an animal wants that, you better believe I'm giving it to them. They can take it. Now, I did my friend request just before, but we got a new one. Thank you, Morgan, for being our friend. I think we're at 96 friends now. I want to see how far we go. So, if you are playing this game, or you have friends who are playing this game, jump on in. Here's my ID. It's in the description, but here it is on screen as well. Jump on in. Let's be friends. Let's be buddies. I'm always trying to buy things off people, trying to flip coconuts and whatnot if someone's selling them for a good price. Uh, so I'm always looking. I wish this was a little bit quicker. Like, I hate the fact that if I click on, uh, say, Jessie here, I see what she's got. She's got beetles. She's selling stuff for, you know, the basic bell price. If I close this, it takes me to the top of the list. Who is, like, the most recent players who is on at the time? So Saucy is on. Zyko's on, Alex is on, Miara's on. And now we have to scroll down to Jesse. Sometimes I get lost. Sometimes I accidentally click on someone when I'm trying to scroll through. And let's say I click on Morgan. And I'm like, ah, oh, she doesn't have anything I want. I close it. I have to scroll back down to Morgan. So it's very clunky in that way of trying to like search people's boxes, their markets. Because you got to click on them and then you got to find them again. On, click on the next person and find them again. Click on it's, it's a pain, man. That's my, uh, like I said in the other parts, my request is for that to be more streamlined, more user-friendly, a little bit easier to use, and we'll use it more. This looks like an olive flounder. He looks a bit bigger than a squid. Could be a tuna. No, it's definitely not a tuna. It's too big. I mean, it's not big enough. The tuna is too big. The tuna is humongous. It's bigger than me, man. We see that shadow in the water. It's a giant. Um, so, do we finish everything with Bunny here? Bunny, 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 bunny. Are you all done? We topped you off. Do you have some new gossip, tee hee? Uh, let's talk. Let's find out. What goss I got? Know what? I thought you of you the other day, and it filled me with warm, fuzzy feelings. For the record, I was also thinking about puppies. So you're in good company. That's That happens a lot. A lot of people think of me, and they get warm, fuzzy feelings. And then they throw up. Uh, let's go to... Let's go to the market very quickly, see what's on sale there. I did buy some stuff this morning, so let's see if it is refreshed. If it's not, that'll make me sad. Also, revelation on Kix. Kix just comes. Kix replaces the Able Sisters. Just like this lady. Sells hats and stuff, sells glasses. So, she comes in. If you remember when you leave, she had the little store next to the Able Sisters, and she sold the accessories. Kicks will come in and do that. So he will take this spot and sell socks and shoes. So my theory was incorrect on him appearing over here. There's just nothing here. Maybe in the future they've got that space for something else. But at the moment, maybe Gracie or even events. But that means every event they have to remove the bench and stuff. So I don't know. We'll see. Uh, do I want a revolving spice rack? Yeah, why not, man? Why not, Tommy? Here's 800 bells. I'm getting a little, uh, going a little freestyle with my bells, man. Wasting them. 
Burn him through him. I'll buy a Zen chair. Why not, man? Uh, I've used a lot of leaf tickets. Every level you go up, you get 10 leaf tickets. Which is why my market has so many slots now. Which is why we have all these slots. But then, I think every fifth level you go up, they give you one. And if this is the max, so if I can only have two more market slots, I was like, I better stop. Because I'm going to get a new one at level 20. And then at level 25, I'm going to get another one. Then level 30, they're going to be like, ah, oh, man, you get nothing. So, could be a waste of leaf tickets. We've also bought the crafting stuff, the extra craft slots. So, the left one is the amenities. So, you can only ever build one amenity at a time. I want to build this, but I need more natural essence. The essence that I have the hardest time getting is the one I have been working on. Which is stupid, man. So, I got plenty of cute tent stuff. I can make cute essence through the roof, man. I'll be able to make all of the cute stuff. Same with the cool stuff. 52 cool stuff. Only thing is the wool. So, if I had not maxed out this, I could have uh, the street set. Like I want a dirty old street in my camp. But, who wants to go to a camp that's got an alleyway in it? That's just, that's messed up. How could you sleep at night? Look at the sporty stuff we got. We got 44 sporty essence now. What? The one I want is the one I'm not getting. The one I don't want, or the, the the ones I don't want, or don't really care for at the moment, I will buy all these things eventually, are the ones I have enough to max out everything I want to max out. So, boo! Give me more, man. Give me more. Let's go invite someone to our campsite. Let's see. Who needs what? Goldie? You want some? Filbert? I'll top you up, my boy. Oh, text. Need another uh, horse mackerel. So Goldie and Filbert will give them their requests, meet their desires, and I think we can invite Butch. Let's find out. I think we have enough things that Butch wants for Butch to come and be a part of our campsite, which will give us a total of seven animals, I think. I don't know. Haven't counted. Never really thought about how many animals we have. Hey, could be seven. We got KK, of course. Ah, uh, Goldie! Of course, we can always talk to the other ones and just ask them what's up. Tell me a story, Goldie. Tell me a story. You've got excellent timing, Rob. Oh, this is gonna be good. Goldie's got Goldie's got one lined up, ready to fire. I just decided I was going to give this to the next person that I talk to. Oh, it, it better be natural essence. The game knows I want it. They're recording my conversations through the microphone. They know I'm desperate for natural essence. And that's why they're denying it of me. I'm going to say this before we get this. Just to test this theory. I don't want natural essence. What's it going to be? Steel? What are you holding on to steel for? Are you a miner? Damn it, dog. It's okay. It's okay. We've, if we fulfill the request, she will give us natural essence, right? Here, have a peach and have a pear. It's all yours. Yum, yum, yum. How lovely, I can't thank you enough. You can. You can thank me enough by giving me natural essence. So I can get on with... You didn't even give me natural essence? How dare you, Goldie? How dare you? How are you always there when I need you, Rob? Thanks a million. Level up. Ah, oh, you didn't even level up. The two highest animal levels I have are both natural characters. And neither of them are dishing out the essence, man. Neither of them. Because if we get enough, we can craft that thing. And I think that this takes... How long does this take? How, it's going to be two days, at least. It is... It is two days. 48 hours. And it will cost 276 leaf tickets to craft it right now. That's way too many, man. Far too many. All right. What's new buck over here? Take this, man. What do you want? You want to build a little bit of everything. So that's 300 bucks. We just made 300 bucks. Giving him some fruit. Don't have to put it in our market. Just give it to the animals. Make some money. Make some bells. Hard-earned cash. I don't know what the exchange rate to bells, to dollars in the real world is. But 300 bells? That's pretty good, man. That sounds like a lot. It sounds like expensive fruit. I've got two words for you. You rule. A lot. Wait, was that more than two? It was. You know what I would like? Two natural essence from you, man. That would have been nice. Since you can't count. Stuck me up, buddy boy. 
What's up, Bucko? Let's talk. Let's talk about natural essence. Now, you're a natural character. I'm judging by your speech bubble there. You've got a, a yellow uh, hue to it. You better hand it up, man. You're level 8. He's gonna do it. Dish it out, man. Dish it out. Dish out the goods. I need my natural essence. Yes. Mmm. Just 50 more to go. And I can make that friggin' picnic set. I just want, I want to make it for you guys. That's the worst part. The more you deny me of your sweat, the less good things I can bring for you. Contacts. All right. I'm fairly certain. Oh, yeah. Butch has invited me. Is it just Butch we can invite? Yeah. Okay. Butch. Butch can come on in, man. What do you need? Set up manually. We need a, a bike, a slide, and that friggin' spinny gym thing. We might have to move some stuff out of the way. But I'm just going to dump it in and then get rid of it. Get it out of there. Don't want it there forever. What's the point, man? What is the point? Alright, Butcho. You want... A bike? You can ride a bike. That's my concert area, man. That's where KK plays. You can ride your precious bike down here. There you go. That could stay. That's not too bad. A slide. You want a slide? A cute slide. Butch is into cute slides. Uh, that could go there, right? That's good fit. That's good fit. Straight into the table. Get a nice dent in your face as you come down that slide. And then this ball of sunshine. Now, uh, let's, let's move the hammock. Let's remove the hammock. Oh, yes. We're doing that. Hammock is gone. We're going playground. We're going full on playground. There we go. Look at that. Look at that. Beautiful, man. I want to put the bike here. Put this thing. I'll check it here. There we go. There we go. That's pretty good. Got a little bit of movement there. I'm going to move this up here. Uh, move the table a little bit. There we go. Not bad. Not bad. Can still cook. Pretend the bike. They Someone rode their bike there to the playground. It's all good. There we go. I'm going to leave that. I'm pretty happy with that. Save that layout. And Butch will come to our town and we'll have earned another animal. And probably, that's probably a stretch goal, right? Could be. Maybe. If it's not, I'll be sad. If it is, it better be a reward of 50 natural essence. Because if it's not, I'll be very sad. Uh, I have one last tip for you before we end this video. And that is... If you've set up your My Nintendo account, which I think you can only do if you're Australian. Uh, if you're in, using an APK, I don't think you can do it. But if you can, great. If you can't, oh, that sucks. But my last tip here is you can get free stuff, man. They will give you free things. I'll show you. I'll show you. Calm down. I know you're, you're going, what? what are you talking about, man? Wait, wait. I like free things. That means I don't have to pay money. That means I get stuff for doing nothing. Well, not quite. Not, not any. Like, you gotta do something. You gotta link your account. And then there are little side missions. Is this a stretch goal? Natural essence? Cool essence? Who the hell wants cool essence? I have more cool essence than anything. I'm dripping of cool essence. Damn it. Alright, so. My Nintendo here. This is what you want. This is where you wanna be. This is the cool kids club. For freebies, man. Look at that. So we've got 80 points. So you've got these things called missions. We can collect now. So complete 10 camper requests. Uh, they change like you get more weekly. So we've got new ones this week. And we can earn... Complete 100 requests. We can earn 100 points. Complete 50. We get 50 points. We just earned uh, 30, I believe. If we link our accounts, we get 300 each. But these ones are weekly. So you always get a way to earn points. Now... I have bought the OK Motors cap. You can buy 5,000 bells. Crafting materials. They don't have essence though. But they do have leaf tickets. So you can get uh, 50 leaf tickets. For I think that was 300. It might have been 100. But it's not bad. But look at this. So I've got 110. I want 5,000 bells. I'm going to take it. Shazam. Give me that. Give me that sweet, sweet bells. Uh, no, no, no. Don't open the browser. Come down, come down. There we go. Scroll down. Redeem. Redeem. Now, we got 5,000 bells. For doing what? For doing nothing. Just completing missions. So now if we go to our uh, mailbox. 5,000 bells. And cool essence. Collect. So now, we have some money. We're a little bit short on cash. We're up. From doing that. Uh, let's see. Who's bought what? Who's bought what? 
Oh, ho! Someone's bought some good stuff. This little bird man bought some coconuts. Like I said, I'm an exporter of coconuts. It's my highest export is coconuts. And someone snapped up the red snappers for 2,500. A saving of 500 bucks. They can earn that back if any animals want it. We need to fill up our store, but first we've got to do all our requests before we go wasting our uh, items. Because what if we put stuff in there that the animals want? That would be stupid. But thank you for watching. I hope you join me in this game. Add me as a friend. Let's play together. Thank <laughs> you.